What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Hope you're all doing well today. It's been quite a while since I've done this sort of video. This is Fast Lines Explained. Now, I've done a couple of these in the past, although very, very long time ago. And the whole concept of this really is I pick a track that is somewhat popular and in this instance it's going to be KI tracks or Kai tracks I still have no idea which one it is and how it's pronounced um, but I'm seeing this one popping up a hell of a lot in servers recently and especially in the Papiti servers the ranked ones so I thought it might be helpful just to get, show you guys what a hot lap looks like show you the lines that I take and some little tips here and there on how you can improve as well at the moment I'm seeing when I go into servers on this track people kind of sitting around the mid 20s so 24 25 26 27 or so well, one minute plus lap times uh, I, a few people seem to dabble in the low 20s maybe 22s maybe they're even getting a 120 in total and then of course you've got the few people that are the uh, the outliers that manage to get that sub sub 120 but whatever level you are and unless of course you're one of them few people that are much faster than me please ignore this video and um, if you need a little bit of help that's what this video is here for a nice and short one you're going to see a lap in orbit just now and i'm going to show you all the lines and kind of talk you through how you should approach the track and hopefully shave a couple of seconds off your lap time and let's get into it in the orbit camera right over the finish line here a nice big scrub to start off with the inside line by best here stay nice and low in the rut if you get a bit too high it's very easy for the back wheel to slide out around the outside in this corner very very smooth on the throttle because then you can really scrub this uh, quad here and downside it nicely a little double down and don't take any rut in this corner apex it from outside inside back to outside staying clear of them ruts is the best thing to help your bike stay nice and stable and carry all your speed scrubbing from the right hand side this jump over to the left and this middle rut down here is the best you haven't got to shut off the whole way down that hill and around that corner even on a 450 again we're going to stay nice and low in this rut here to avoid our bike getting all weird we're going to double double to the inside rut down here and then you're going to want to jump to the inside over the inside roller you want to go in the second rut in this corner i found it the best for carrying your speed stay nice and low over this and check up a little bit for this jump if you jump a bit too far here the bike is prone to slide now over those bumps stay nice and low in that corner missing as much of the rut as possible nice and smooth over that triple wall quad step down to the inside inside ruts there to limit the track as much as possible and then another inside here all of these ruts are built nice and big so you can carry all the speed that you need to little double double again before this inside as fast as you can over the finish line and that lap that you saw right there was a one minute 18.01 I believe uh, so very very good lap I think that might even be world record at the moment if we go over to the Papiti service it's probably not world record overall uh, but I, I really really enjoy this track I was a bit hit and miss with it at first when I was playing it online just because of how fast it is but I've kind of I've, I've come to come to love it um, it's one that's really really helped me out on my uh, road to rank one journey because you get some quite full lobbies in there and if you know all the correct lines it's usually quite easy to place quite highly I've probably screwed myself over now by <laughs> by showing everyone all the lines that I take uh, but I'm sure if you go into testing and you try these lines out compared to whatever issue you was taking previously you may well find that you've gained a good second or two seconds a lap key round here is to be nice and smooth on your steering very very easy just to get the back end a little bit loose and slide out very easy to tuck the front end if you're pushing it too hard in the corners as well and when you're apexing these flat corners here and missing the inside ruts just don't try and steer too tight you need to try and open up the corner as much as possible to carry all of that speed and i hope you've enjoyed hopefully this will save you a few seconds here and there let me know what tracks you would like to see next i'm more than open to doing some more of these i do actually really really enjoy them and if you enjoyed the video please do drop a like subscribe to the channel if you're new hope you have a lovely rest of the day whatever it is you're up to and until i catch you in the next video peace